What's up everybody? It's your girl Tierra on the Madam Boss Lady channel and we are in the Elf. About to see just how fast this thing goes. Now I don't know a real way of trying to figure out how it how fast it goes except to put it on a GPS. Because when you put it on GPS, the GPS tells you how fast you're going and how fast you're supposed to be going. The posted speed limit and then how fast you're going. So that's the way I chose to do this. And a few more little tidbits that one of my um, viewers was telling me about, I'll be happy to let you guys know. So let's get this thing started. So as you can see, I am here at the Nazarene Church and it's a big open lot. Gives me plenty of time to speed up and just see how fast this can go. I won't be running into nothing, I hope. <laughs> and then I have the GPS at the Nazarene Church. So I'm gonna see just how fast this thing goes. Okay, to start off with, these are the lights. They, it's not dark dark, but they are pretty bright. You can see, um, how bright they are a little bit but they're LED so you already know the LEDs are kind of bright and then the running lights are pretty bright too I'll show you a little bit later on when it gets darker but um, let me put on the turn signal okay so that's that's the turn signal I would say that it, I mean, it should be able to be seen at night. I've never ridden this bike at night, but it looks pretty bright to me. We're gonna see in a few minutes. This is like our little test run. So yeah, it's not quite as dark in this, on this uh, film as it is um, here. But yeah, I mean, it's pretty bright. All right, let's get this thing started. Let's see what we got. Okay, how am I gonna do this? Oh my God, this is crazy. Hold on, let me see. All right. Okay, that ain't right. All right, let's see what it do. We have the 10 miles, 11 miles per hour. I'm trying to, I'm tired of trying to make this work. We just about to see how fast it goes. Cause I don't know how in the world to make this thing record. It's funny as heck right now, but I'm gonna tell you, you just gonna have to trust me. Hold on. Okay. I got up to 20 miles per hour. <laughs> 20 miles per hour. Oh my God. And it was kind of fun. Um, and the charge on here, let me see. I didn't fully charge it, but it has a whole system um, that tells you everything. This is the information system. And I don't, I have no idea what half of this stuff means. But even with the lights on, because the lights are still on, this is still, I, I started at right about half. So it really didn't run anything down. I only been out here a few minutes. But the whole purpose was to do this, um, Thing at night. I've never gotten on this bike at nighttime, and I also want to see how fast it goes. And then I'm going to try to pull out my LED lights so I can see how they look before I install them because it's dark. So let's get to that. So I'm about to hook up these um, LED lights, the strip lights, but one of my viewers who I don't really want to say his name because I didn't get permission to do that, he said that they have running lights, which I guess these are the running lights that whether you, as long as the key is put in and as long as um, the, the information screen is up, the running lights are on. So I did not know that. I appreciate it, viewer. <laughs> so I got... Um, let me show you what I got here. Oh, and before I do that, he also told me that you aren't supposed to roll this 
plastic thing. It's, it actually has a Velcro on it and you're supposed to be able to, you know, lift it up and stick it to the Velcro and it does stay. But he says that they say not to do that because it gets these scratches and, and uh, marks on it to where it will eventually break. Mine doesn't have any. It's still in pretty good condition. Um, not sure how old his is or you know how that works or whatnot but so far i haven't had that issue um i probably won't roll it up anymore i'll just take his advice because why would he tell me that if it's not true <laughs> so i am going to show you guys the lights that i have okay so i went to my favorite spot in the world ross and i got this led light that is 7.99 this is what the package looks like it's just like some strip lights and I uh, took it out of the package. This how it's packaged. Oh, I just dropped the remote. And then here's the strips itself. So what I did was I have a power box or a juice box. And all I'm going to do is plug it in. I hope y'all can hear me. And it does this little network of lights or whatnot. And then, you see, there's a remote that goes with it. And so I can change the, darn it, I can change the tempo of the lights, the color of the lights. It tells you all the things that you can do. And so I'll just put that around the perimeter of the bike and um, see what it all entails. <laughs> now this particular strip is only six feet long. And I ended up buying a few more. So I have quite a few different ones. This one's 10 feet, this one's seven feet. And uh, the prices range from, this is also $7.99. This one was $6.99. I picked up another one today for $5.99. I won't need more than about four or five maybe, because I'm not sure how I want to put them on there. But yeah, each one of them come with a remote, which I won't need that too much. And I hope they interact with each other, but um, so that I can change the lights on it as I drive. And I have uh, this LED, this, um, battery pack has two ports of course you saw i dropped it so it has two ports on it so i can run two lights at the same time and i have two of these batteries so at this point yeah i'm uh <laughs> yeah at this point i'm not going to install the lights but i just wanted you to see um exactly what i was doing let me try to get this off of here so you can because it's dark now maybe you can see the um maybe you can see the oh i'm gonna turn on the ignition maybe you can see the lights better i don't know why that's such a big deal to me but yeah okay so now because this is the actual bike go around the back way this is how bright the lights are in the dark so yeah you can actually be seen from a pretty good distance and then when you go around front, the lights are pretty bright as well. So that's not to say that you can't get hit. That's that. That's to say that you shouldn't get hit. These suckers are pretty bright. So I just wanted to touch bases with you guys and show you uh, some of the features that I have that you could only see at night and some of the light fi features that I was trying to put on here. Show you guys a little bit about how it works at night, which I did not know that because I've never taken this bike out at nighttime. So I'm pretty excited to see how, how bright the lights really are. I mean, I had it out at nighttime, but I've never driven it. So I'm actually about to get on the Elf and bike home and just enjoy the ride. I'm getting ate up by mosquitoes. That's not cute. <laughs> but yeah, I'll be back to show you what the bike looks like with the lights on it. Make sure that you guys subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to like this video if you did. If you have any questions or comments that you want to put um, in the comment section, let me know and I'll be happy to try to answer them. And be sure to follow me on this channel if you like this, uh, what I'm doing as far as the bike goes. And make sure that you follow me on all social media except for Twitter at Madam Boss Lady. Good. I'm really just trying to see how long this battery lasts. Now that I know how fast it goes, 
I wanna see how long the battery lasts. I'm gonna put a full charge on here and just go full throttle, see how long it goes when it's on full throttle till it, the battery dies. And then I'll charge it back up just to go on a regular ride and see what it does with the intermittent um, hill driving or whatever we're gonna call it. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty interested in trying to figure that part out too. So yeah, I just, I just um, took a few minutes to try to get you guys to see um, some of the features that I could not show you in the daytime. And here they are. If you have any input on the elf bike or elf elf transit make sure that you say something in the comments let me know what your take is on the elf bike yes yeah i'm still gonna pedal a little bit this is a nice little scenic it's a nice night tonight it was raining all this time which took me this long to get this video together because i kept getting rained out so now that i'm on my way look how light those leds are come on y'all Y'all see me pedaling in the dark. <laughs> wow. These cars is not slowing down, so this is why I had to know how fast I can go because <laughs> he's telling me to go. This is pretty dope. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to run this battery all the way down. I don't know, I'm not quite as bright as her lights, but hunty. It's not as loud as um, a scooter scooter. I mean, it is loud. When it first takes off, it sounds like a, I don't know what it sounds like, but it makes a lot of noise. Well, not a lot of noise. I'll stop it and then, I'll stop it and then start it so you guys can hear. All right, I'm at dead stop. Yeah, so the startup is not that bad. It, it does make a noise but it's not horrible. Now you guys might wait for this um, speaker that I put in. I'm gonna have, <laughs> he's probably just recording me. Um, I'm gonna have my, um, I'm gonna have it fully decked out the next time I bring it on to the show so that you guys can see just how ghetto it's gonna be. <laughs> gonna be ghetto but it's gonna be it's gonna be nice i've seen them done and i think they look beautiful so that's exactly what i'm trying to do classy cute fun you can ride this mug downtown with all the rest of the bikers we'll see and i don't know they ride in the they ride in the summertime but i'm all right with riding in the fall because i need it feels good out here tonight so yeah but anywho make sure you follow me on this channel Madam Boss Lady channel. Also follow me on all social media at Madam Boss Lady except for Twitter. And be sure to like and subscribe to this channel and share this video. All right, thanks a lot guys for watching. I'm out. <laughs>